I am Santosh Gaidanuk. Today's concept is about lubrication and bearing. This is the formula. Sorry, question. SAE20 oil is used to lubricate a hydrodynamic bearing. The journal bearing of diameter 75 mm and the length is 75 mm. Oil enters at 40 degree. There is a room temperature is given. The journal rotates at 1200 rpm. The diameter clearance is 75 mm. Assume operating temperature of the oil is 73 degrees Celsius and determine the magnitude location of the minimum film thickness, power loss, oil flow through the bearing, and side leakage. Now, whatever the given, first write the given here. Data is given. SAE. 20 oil D 75 mm I will convert into meter 0 0.075 meter length 75 mm I will convert into 0 0.05 meter what is given oil enters at you can write TI or TA is equal to 40 degree n is given 1200 rpm if you n dash is nothing but what tool you are by 60 you will get around 20 rps 20 rps and next diameter clearance is given c is given time to clearance 0.075 meter i will write directly in terms of meter it is 75 mm i will write in terms of meter here diameter clearance is oh sorry the diameter clearance they have given in terms of 0.075 This is mm, they have given it. 0.075 into 10 to two minus 3 meter. Operating temperature is 53 degrees Celsius. Now, solution. Diameter clearance is nothing but what? Diameter clearance. is nothing but C by D it is a ratio cleanse ratio okay. it is a ratio C by D 0 0.075 divided by 0 0.075 it is nothing but D value is nothing but what D value is nothing but the value for this one is the thing something 10 raised to minus 3. The value will be 0 0.001. 0 0.001. 0 0.001. Okay. Now, <clears throat> from the table, SAE will go for the refer the table. Please refer the figure because SAE 20 oil is given. I will go for the SAE 20 oil. Here, two 20s are given. All year automobile SAE 20 and automobile oil SAE 20. I will consider this one. E is the number. E is the number figure. 24.1 page number 24.6 I will select E number E number next I will refer the figure 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 24.2 page number 
24.5 here operating temperature is given here operating temperature is given 53 this is the 53 e we have selected e line we have selected 53 and e is nothing but around 32 32 <coughs> Data will be 32 CP. That means 32 into 10 raised to minus 3 Pascal second. Okay. After getting this one, once you find out this one, you have to find out what magnitude and location of the minimum frame thickness. <coughs> magnitude and location of minimum frame thickness. Now, what is minimum flame thickness is nothing but delta is nothing but 2h mean divided by c. We have to find out the delta. How to find out the delta? We don't know. If you go for summer field number, the formula for summer field number is s is equal to n dash into n divided by p 1 divided by psi square. Okay, we don't know about the P because W is not given. If the summer field number is in, summer field number is known, then we can go for the Raimondes table and we can find out everything. But this is unknown for us. Uh, as this is also unknown, these are unknown, therefore not possible. Then how to find out this delta? Delta can be found by by using this formula. By using this formula, this formula b is equal to pi d b naught divided by 360. We will use this one b b is equal to pi d b naught divided by 360. Here b naught you have to consider as 364 full journal bearing. Formula is 24.19 page number 24.9. P is nothing but what? Pi into 0 0.075. You know the P. Now, please refer. Okay, we have to refer this formula. Uh, we have to go further. Now to refer this one. B by L, we have to find out length of the direction of the motion divided by length of the direction of the perpendicular motion L. Therefore, B by L is nothing but what? You have to find out the B by L. B by L is nothing but pi into 0 0.075 divided by 0 0.075. Answer will be 3.142. This can be obtained by figure 24.24 page number. 24.27 after knowing this one we have to find out cw this value we have to find out load leakage factor we have to find out how to find out this one how to find out this one now my value is around we required what cw CW. This is the formula. This CW we have to find out. My value comes around this one. If you if you go for the scale, the value will be around 0 0.085. 3 0.1 CW, the value will be around 0 0.0. <coughs> I will just zoom it out. This is the value 3.1. I have to find out the CW. This is the CW. The value will be 0 0.086. CW will be 0 0.086. Now, again, after getting the CW, just refer the one more table here. This is the graph I have to refer. This is the graph I have to refer. B by W is B by L is nothing but what? 3.1 this is the 3.1 c 
CW value is nothing but what? 0.08. It is around here. Therefore, I have to consider delta is equal to 0.8. I have to consider delta is equal to 0.8. CW value is nothing but 0.08. It appears in this way here. Therefore, I have to consider delta is equal to 0.8. You have to refer after this one, you have to refer figure 24.26 page number 24.28. Then you will get delta value as 0.8 because CW values rise here 0.086. The nearest value for delta is 0.8. After getting the delta 8 everything is very simple go for the table number for number table this table you have to refer it first volume the purpose first volume it will be up so that it can be seen properly now this table i will refer for solving the problem okay now i got delta is equal to 0 0.8 now this 0 0.8 value where l by l is nothing but 1 here l by d is nothing but 1 therefore 1 delta is obtained as 0 0.8 Easy to find. This is the S value. This is the phi value. By using this one, you can find out the mu. By using this one, you can find out the Q. By using this one, you can find out QQS. Now I will find one by one. Once I get delta is equal to 0 0.8, I will go for the summer fold number. go for summer full number here l by d is nothing but what 0 0.075 divided by 0 0.075 is nothing but 1 and delta value is nothing but 0 0.8 this is the 0 0.8 then i will go for finding the summer full number yes yes then i will find the summer full number S is nothing but what? The value for S is nothing but 0 0.8. S will be 0 0.631. 631. This is that they have asked to find out the summer fold number. Okay. Okay, okay. I just forgotten to uh, find the minimum th film thickness. After getting the delta, substitute the value here. You will get minimum, H minimum. That means 0 0.8 into C will be 0 0.075 into 10 raised to minus 3 divided by 2. You will get H minimum. The H minimum is nothing but what? The value is around 3 into 10 raised to minus 3 meter. Okay, after finding the H minimum. I will find out the magnitude also. Now, after getting the summer full number, this is the value of summer full number. What is the formula for summer full number? S is equal to N. Data dash is equal to P into 1 divided by psi square. Psi square. S is given 0 0.631. Data is nothing but 32 into 10 raised to minus 3. 20 divided by P into 1 divided by 0 0.001 whole square the p value will be the p value will be 1.01 into 10 raised to 4 into 10 raised to 6 newton per meter square this is the power 
pressure in the belly can be obtained. This is the pressure in the belly can be obtained. Once you get in the pressure in the belly, you can find out E value. This is the E value you can find out directly. It is nothing but 0 0.2. That is attitude. Attitude. Attitude is nothing but E is nothing but what? 0 0.2. Directly obtained by using the um, remedies and voice chart. Once you get attitude, you can find out uh, maximum magnitude, magnitude, magnitude is nothing but phi, phi is nothing but 74.02. After getting the phi, you can find out the coefficient of friction mu, mu is nothing but psi, e is nothing but 12.8, where mu is nothing but where mu is nothing but 12.8 into psi, psi is nothing but 0 0.001, the answer will be 0 0.0128. After getting the coefficient of friction, you can find out the <coughs> Q, Q value, that is oil flow through the bearing. Q is nothing but oil flow through the body, bearing. bearing that is q that is 4 q 4 q this is the formula i will write psi d square n dash l is nothing but what is the value they are given at 0 0.8 it is around 3 point 3.59 3.59 3.59 where q is nothing but what 3.59 into 0 0.001 into 0 0.075 into 0 whole square into 20 into 0 0.075 divided by 4 the q value will be 7.57 into 10 raised to minus 6 meter cube per second now flow through the bearing Side leakage, side leakage is nothing but QS value. Side leakage is nothing but QS divided by Q. The for QS value is nothing but 0 0.0.280. Zero side leakage. QS by Q is nothing but 0 0.2. 0 0.280. Therefore, QS is nothing but 0 0.280 into 7.57 into 10 raised to minus 6. The answer will be 2.120 into 10 raised to minus 6 meter cube per second. Now we have to find out the we have to we have find out the magnitude. Magnitude we have find out it. Attitude we have find out it. Then we have to find out the power loss. Power loss. Power loss is nothing but heat. What is power loss? Power loss is nothing but heat dissipated. Or heat dissipated. Or heat generated. Heat generated. The formula for this one is nothing but either you can go for NU is equal to mu w v this is a formula here a power loss you can use this formula mu w v this is a formula or you can use this formula i will use this formula now power loss instead of this one i will use this one mu W pi d n dash divided by thousand. Page number twenty four point forty nine B. Page number twenty four point two two. U is the thing but zero point zero one two eight. W is the thing but what? 
PLD. What is PLD? P value. P value is the number 1.014 into 10 raised to 6 into L 0 0.075 into 0 0.075 into pi into 0 0.075 into 20 divided by 1000. The answer for this one is nothing but what? We'll go for calculation 0 0.0128 into 1.014 into 10 raised to 6 into 0 0.075 to 0 0.075 into pi into 0 0.075 into 20 divided by 1000. The answer for this one is nothing but uh, for power is nothing but zero point three four four zero kilobyte. If you want to convert into watt, Vats. I am Santosh Badankar. Thank you very much.